Hello, this is Alfonso, and this is episode 4 of Let's Play Majora's Mask. I had to do post-commentary on this one because the original commentary file just died. It's been a busy weekend for me, as you can tell. I haven't posted anything for quite a few days, and I have made a promise to do one every day. However, I went to a bachelor party, a wedding, all over the weekend. And I was too pooped to do anything else other than sleep. Anyways, but here we go. So, what, I, what I'm doing in this episode is... I'm going to beat Woodfall Temple very fast compared to a normal playthrough. But it's slow compared to a speedrun because I messed up a few times. So, what I'm doing here is activating the Infinite Sword Glitch to uh, bomb hover over to that ledge. Which you would normally need a bunch of keys to get to. I'm not collecting a single key in this dungeon. Not even the boss key. If I, when I do this successfully, I will get the bow and arrow, which I will need to defeat Odawa and a lot of other bosses in the game because the bow is one of the most important weapons in the game that you can find. I'll put some decky sticks there so I could, uh, beat this next guy. This guy is pretty amazing. I'm used to just, uh, what we call it, jump slashing and hitting him, so I just decided to just take one of my decky sticks because he was being a douchebag that battle. And I get my bow without getting any keys. I think that's pretty amazing. Da -da -da -da. And blah da blah. Everybody knows how to use the bow. And I go back to the main room because what else is there to do? There's nothing else to do in this dungeon except for fight the boss now. Which I will do easily. I will defeat the boss. I'm using this bomb to kill those butterflies right there. They will mess up if they catch up to me after I'm done. After I did. Uh, after I'm doing what I do. Oh, uh, what I'm doing is clipping through this wall using the Zora's mask. You can. There's different ways to clip through it. You can clip through using bombs. But Zora's mask is, is one of the easiest ways to do it, and it doesn't use any explosives. And I need these bombs for this. I specifically needed 19 bomb shoes for the entire backflip, the uh, bomb hover backwards. I have to line myself up properly, and when I do it correctly, I will bomb hover 19 bomb shoes back. And the ideal hover for the regular bombs is 5. But I messed up a few times there, which is why I still have an excessive amount of bombs left. It's not excessive, really. I really needed those bombs. What it's doing is the room where the boss door is is not loading. So I'm out of bounds right now in the main room. And since those textures aren't loaded, I can just go straight to the boss door without any hindrances. One of the side bomb hop is essentially the same thing as the backwards, as the backflip bomb hover. However, I just have to press right and side hop at the same time. Okay. I'm using way too many bombs in this one, but I wanted to get through it. And then I just back walk in. I'm at the boss. No keys. I got my bow. I got everything I needed to do. Woo! Come on, it's victory. Sword slash, come on. There we go. I'm gonna get us some hearts now because... Ugh, I just feel uncomfortable going into a boss with less hearts than I need. Or want, or something like that. Oh, no. 
Stalwa. I'm sure you've seen a video of me. I don't know, you probably haven't, but I have a video on my YouTube of a speedrun attempt that I did over uh, Justin TV, was it? Or Twitch TV? Where I beat this guy, like, really easily, so this one is being a dick already. Without. Since my first arrow didn't hit. Ah! Uh, I always hate that. I mean, I've done better before, but. What are, what are you gonna do? There we go. Okay. Now this guy's really easy once you get. If you just hit him just right. And I don't have to wait for him to do any of his special things, and he's dead. It took me six minutes. It usually takes me six minutes to get the first key in a normal playthrough. Let's do a victory spin. Yay. Now to get his remains. And then I'm out of here because I have freed the innocent spirit that has plagued the mask. I'm getting to learn my song now. What's that? It's like a giant of some sort. These giants will come into play later in the game when I when the moon needs to go back up. Wait, listen. It seems to be saying something. Could that crying be its way of teaching us some sort of melody? Don't, just stand there, get your instrument. Could this be the song? Come on, play it. This is the way it goes. Come on, play it, Link. I don't want to play it forever. Come on. I mean, Alfonso. the oath to order Who the heck is Link anyways? It's like c call us that's what it's saying it's like every time he warps somewhere, he warps to a secret area that doesn't even make sense. It's not in the realm of reality. Neither is this thing. It's like outside the realm of the outside of the realm of reality. Something like that. And now the swamp is not poisoned. It's all clear. It's all good. The four people Tail talked about. Do you think he was talking about the spirit that was sealed inside the mask? Oh, hey, you're pretty good out there. Have you done this before or what? Now, just keep up that pace and save the other three. Hey, um... Champagne? All that stuff I did to you, your horse, I, I apologize. Sorry. There, I apologize. I don't hold it against me. Got it? 
now. Then we've helped the princess, just like the monkey asked. So now our next stop is the mountain. Let's go. We need to go. Whoa, what's that behind you? Well, I haven't looked around this room before. Well, there we go. There's nothing really much. I'm not saving that princess. She can save herself. Hmm. I need to go back and do some stuff. Um, I'm gonna slow time down. Here because... Oh, I'm gonna speed the time up because I need to do something at 12 o'clock tonight. I need to get that bigger bomb bag. Whoop. Aww. Too far of a jump link. How would you do that? Okay. Well, there's nothing really here, so I don't know what I'm doing. I just had the urge to kill some bushes. Now, to go back to Clock Town and dupe some bottles and get some bomb bags. Bigger bomb bags and all that stuff. There's nothing to really do much here. So I decided to see if I could get the 100 rupees early. And I can't, so. I'm essentially just killing time until 12 o'clock. It's a waste of time, really. I would cut it out if. My video editing program didn't make the quality so low afterwards. I need to some more practice with that, so I'm gonna try it later. But as I said, I went to a bachelor party, went to a wedding. After the bachelor party, I was pooped. Couldn't do anything for two days straight. And after the wedding, which was yesterday, I couldn't do anything during the wedding day, so... Today was my first free day in quite a while. Oh, and my summer term of class has started, so... Luckily, it's only one class. I don't have to do much. But in order to do some duping, I need to get some masks, so... I don't know what I'm doing here. Messing up is what I'm doing. I decided at the last minute I need to get some masks. Oopsie doodle. Yep, time to get some masks. I believe the one I'm getting is the Bremen mask. And after I get the bigger... After I destroy the thief, I'll get the, the bomb mask, which I will dupe into another bottle. The reason I'm duping bottles is so I can do the Zora quest. Get the eggs and learn the song. I don't even know what he said. I don't care. I just wanted the Bremen mask so I could dupe it. I'm a dirty duper. <laughs> duper. And the way to dupe it is to sell it to this. to sell any item in a bottle to this guy. The trick is to, after after you press I take it, you press start as, as much as possible, and then eventually you just get it. And you put an item that you don't want anymore into the slot where the item you sold is. And so I'm going to try it again with, you can do it with any item in the game. Bomb shoes, masks, Ocarina of Time. I wouldn't recommend that. You need that. <laughs> and then there's some lag. I 
I really hated the lag playing this one, but that's what Fraps does. Even on a fairly powerful PC, but whatever. This was crippling lag. Okay, there we go. Take it. Did I, did I, and, oh, I didn't do it that time. You have to be really, really fast with the reflexes in order to do it correctly. So, we killed some time. Still have some time to kill. Or do I? Nope, oh, there's some lag. That's what's killing time right now. Exit the door, Link! You can do it! Oi, vey! Door link, come on. Okay, made sure I got the brand of Okay, lag! There's so much lag! to head to North Clock Town because at a certain time a thief will come to steal the delivery of the bigger bomb bag. And if I don't and if I stop him, I'll be able to purchase the bigger bomb bag which will allow me to hurt which will allow me to hold thirty bombs and thirty bomb shoes. I'm I'll eventually be getting the biggest bomb bag from a Deku scrub in the Goron City. I'll need two hundred rupees and the bigger bomb bag. And I'll be able to hold 40 bombs and 40 bomb shoes, which will help me immensely in scaling Ikana Canyon. Later on, that is. I'm just killing time, waiting for the little old mother. I'm gonna activate the infinite sword glitch so I can just walk up to the guy and just hit him with a sword without having to draw it or target or anything. We'll make it a lot easier. A lot easier. I don't want to deposit any mail. But now I just gotta wait. And there she is. Just walking along, trying to deliver. Oh, there's a thief. Little douchebag trying to steal from an old lady. What a douche. Ouch! Watch out! Flag! Stop! Thief! Give! The old lady! The luggage bag! And I just walk up to him and. Whoop! Even the sword glitch took care of him. Uh-uh, you're not gonna get any of this. Just guard it. Just wait for him to leave. And he's gone. He's out of here, mother... You heard what I said. And I get my... Yes, thank you. It must have been dangerous. Of course, I get my blast mask. Which I won't be using this game, because I'm gonna do it into a bottle. Well, maybe I might be able to use it if I go back and down. I don't know yet. Now to go dupe the rest of my bottles. Oi. This part I do want to come out. Well, maybe if I find some way to cut it out, it'll inexplicably do something on YouTube. But, then again, I also want to keep, have the complete playthrough with no cuts. So, I'll see. I'll see what happens. You can, as long as you have an item in the bottle, you can possibly use, you can use it to be duped. Okay. Gonna pay me good for it. Am I gonna dupe it? No, yeah, I'm gonna dupe it. And then I only need one more bottle for duping. 
I guess the way I duped this way, though, also helped me, because I needed... I, I duped to 200 rupees. That was gonna take a while. But using those two, 200 rupees, I bought the bigger bomb bag. I withdrew 10, do 10 rupees from my um, bank of thingamajig. And bought 30 bomb shoes, so um, I'm pretty much set for the game with those bomb shoes for a while. I didn't do it right, no! So I gotta keep on doing it again and again and again, repetitive until I do it. So, um, while this is going on, I'm gonna just, uh, talk about nonsense. Whoa, nope. Kitty's coming into play. Okay. No. Oh well. Fine, leave me. I have the Thriller album with me right now. Let's read the booklet to see what song tracks are on it. I can't even read, it's so dim in this room. Uh, oh, it has lyrics. Uh, I'm gonna sing, I'm gonna, not sing some lyrics, but I'm gonna, if I find the song I like, <laughs> I'm gonna read some lyrics. Thriller. Alright, I'll be right back to turn on the light so I can do something about this. Okay. It's close to midnight and something evil's lurking in the dark. Under the moonlight you see a sight that almost stops your heart. You try to scream, but terror takes the sound before you make it. You start to freeze as horror looks you right between the eyes. You're paralyzed. Cause this is Thriller. Thriller night. <laughs> and no one's gonna save you from the beast about to strike. You know it's Thriller, Thriller Night. You're fighting for your life inside a killer, Thriller Tonight. You hear the door slam and realize there's nowhere left to run. You feel the cold hand and wonder if you'll ever see the sun. You close your eyes and hope that this is just imagination. But all the while, you hear a creature creeping up behind. You're out of time. Cause this is Thriller, Thriller Night. There ain't no second chance against the thing with 40 eyes. You know it's Thriller, Thriller Night. You're fighting for your life inside a killer. Thriller tonight. Night creatures call and the dead start to walk in their masquerade. There's no escaping the jaws of the alien this time. They're open wide. This is the end of your life. They're out to get you. There's demons closing in on every side. They will possess you unless you change the number on the dial. Now this is the time you and I to cuddle close together. And through the night, I'll save you from the terrors on the screen. I'll make you see that it's a thriller. Thriller night, because I can thrill you more than any ghost would dare to try. <laughs> um, girl, this is thriller, thriller night. So let me hold you tight and share a killer. Diller, chiller, thriller here tonight. Rap performed by Vincent Price. Okay, that wasn't supposed to be read, but I don't give a crap. Darkness falls across the land. The midnight hour is close at hand. Creatures crawl in the search of blood to terrorize y'all's neighborhood. And whosoever shall be found without the soul for getting down must stand and face the hounds of hell and rot inside a corpse's shell. The foulest stench is in the air, the funk of 40,000 years and grisly ghouls from every tomb are closing in to seal your doom. And though you fight to stay alive, your body starts to shiver. For no mere mortal can resist the evil of the thriller. And that was Thriller 
by um, featuring rap by Vincent Price, Greg Fulginus, Rod Temperton, and Brian Banks. Synthesizers, Anthony Marilyn Mer. Wow, you need to freaking get some good names here. Anthony Marinelli, synthesizer programming, David Williams guitar. And just beat it, beat it, 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 beat it, beat it. No one wants to be defended. Showing how funky and strong is your fight. It doesn't matter who's wrong or right. Um, and that's Thriller and Part of Beat It by Michael Jackson. Was it written by Michael Jackson? I don't know. It's possibly done. Alright. Okay, and that is gonna be... This is my last attempt at a dupe. And I think I did it properly. Yep, I did it properly. So now I gotta go buy my bigger bomb bag. I don't really need that fish anymore. But I don't care. Oh, lag! Oh my gosh, there's lag all over the place, man! Bomb shop, time for some bomb bags, mother fricker! Welcome. Talk to the shopkeeper and leave. No, I want my big bomb back for 90 rupees. And then I'll leave it. Get the heck out of here. I'm indecisive about wanting to buy bomb shoes right now, because I know I need the 10 rupees to buy the 30 bomb shoes. Because I have 110 gold. Rupees, and I need 120 to buy 30 bomb shoes. I always keep on leaving and exiting, leaving and exiting, but I get my bomb shoes eventually. I withdraw the 10 rupees from my bank guy that I haven't used for quite a while. It's weird. Whenever I don't want to talk to him, I talk to him. When I want to talk to him, it's difficult. I don't know why, but it just is. Mm-hmm. Get my bomb shoes. Which I thought was an obvious ploy on Pikachu. Chu, bomb chu. It looks like a mouse. Pikachu's a mouse type creature. I'm sure no one's put that comparison together before ever in the history of Zelda. Just give me my bomb shoes. Okay. Let's equip all my stuff. Let's get. Let's just get to Zora's domain. And learn the get the hookshot and the new wave bossa nova, which will be done in next episode, which I hope to get out tomorrow. I don't have anything planned, so should see a steady supply of videos again. I'm going to do live commentary next time. I just had to do it this time because I'd already recorded this video prior, but I messed up my live commentary and I didn't want to do it again. So, yep, I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow, and which I will get the hookshot and the new wave bossa nova. So, I'm going to slow down time first so I can keep on doing it. And I will see you guys next week. Not next week, next tomorrow. Well, yeah, see you guys tomorrow. I won't see you, but you know what I mean. <laughs> Alrighty then. Goodbye.